Hey everyone, welcome back to Essence Awaken on my YouTube channel. Um, if you have not, please like, share, and subscribe. I definitely appreciate it. This is going to be a general reading. Um, I haven't done one in a long time like this, so I'm going to go ahead and jump right into it. Uh, we have given up Sao victim um victim um like playing victim bright side new beginnings and this is a 10 of um the 10 of clubs if anyone if you guys do not know this is my tarot deck essence awakened you can find it on my etsy shop okay the link is going to be um down below in the description um you can be able to purchase these to learn how to do tarot with playing cards we have Joker, unlimited potential, stimulus, um, simulation, endings, beginnings, big risks, okay? So something w that you felt like that you gave up on, that gave you a lot of uh, sorrow, um, this person could have been playing in the mindset of... Um, like i just had it this person that you probably was dealing with because you gave up on it had gave you just a lot of sorrow because it was playing victim too much they wasn't um trying to look on the brighter side they wasn't trying to start a new beginning with you okay collective this person had a lot that they were dealing with um, on their end. I really feel like they should have did some type of cleansing for themselves. Um, I, I'm hearing not on the same page. Very, uh, very much a victim mentality. Okay. You felt in the beginning with this person because we have the Joker and this is like, um, you know, um, the full card taking a, cause it says taking a big risk. Um, you just put you put a lot into the situation with this person this you know this is what i'm picking up okay i know it's a general reading but this is what i'm picking up um give me some more information we have time apart yeah so you definitely is giving up on this person so you told this person that you guys needed time apart some distance will will help bring clarity you needed to bring you need to have more clarity into the situation okay just to let everyone know take the rose how it resonates for you um you know you know how the roles are just to let everyone know this is a general message this is for um entertainment pur entertainment purposes only okay we have finances financial challenges are affecting this connection so this also dealing with with this having this card Finances, I really feel like this person wasn't giving. They wasn't doing a give and take. You were giving more than this person was giving, okay? This person was working, but I'm hearing like probably part-time or barely even working, making excuses, not wanting to do anything, okay? Not making the time or the effort to take a risk on themselves or even this relationship to have new beginnings, to um, to build a solid foundation, you know, I'm hearing that this this foundation that you guys had, it was built on sand, okay? We have leap of faith. It is safe to make the move you're considering. So type of some type of move that is being stagnant that you're not wanting to take with this person. I'm seeing this person texting you or messaging you, um, and you're just like, no, denial. Detach with love to clearly see the truth. So this was um, diagonal. Um, and horizontal so i'm really feeling like this person um in a certain time i feel like this person or you in horizontal i feel like you're in denial i feel like you kind of want to give this person a chance but you needing to clearly see because with the time apart as well you need to understand that everything happens for a reason and only certain people are in your life for a season Okay, let me grab some more cards for the collective. Spirit, what do we have for the collective? Let's see here. Yeah, I'm hearing like seasons are changing, you know. Um, you need to do work on yourself, self-care, okay. 
see. Give me some more information for the collective for this reading. Yeah, this, this person made it seem like it was you, but it was actually them. They was very much in a victim mentality, okay? A lot of sorrow, a lot of hesitation I'm hearing. We have closed off, guarded, and uh, resistant. That came out in reverse. So I feel like that that could be you feeling like they're, that they were very closed off and guarded, okay? You could have also been guarded within yourself, trying to see, you know, having that denial, okay resisting change okay not I, I don't know why i keep put, picking up air energy really really heavy air energy and i'm picking up aquarius okay we have transparency oh transcendent and unity this is in reverse there was no unity okay or you could have been dealing with the aquarius okay let's see what else we have we have fate detours divine intervention okay so there was a lot of divine intervention with the situation um that was in reverse so that is telling me that it's over with something that you wasn't trying to hear collective okay yeah female you could someone is connecting with their um with their higher self this could be a masculine energy. It could also be a female energy just because it has female. You could be balancing that out. We have comfort zone, self node. So I feel like you're not clingy anymore to the situation. I feel like you're past the test. I'm picking up. I could have I could I'm also picking up the energy that you could have been dealing with a fire sign or they have fire in their chart. You had to take the leap of faith of courage of walking away. Yeah. That's why we have given up. Cycles, change, and completion. Something has been completed. Some type of change. Um, I'm With the butterfly over her mouth, I'm picking up a fact of butterfly energy, of the change of mindset, of your throat chakra, speaking out how you feel. Okay, collective, anything else? Yeah, we have deception, temptation. So this person is trying to come back around and tempt you. Okay. Yeah, you thought that this was a twin flame connection. It wasn't with this deception card. They de they deceived you to make you think that this that they were your twin flame. Okay, and they wasn't. Now I know this is a masculine on here, but it could also be a female energy as well. Just take the rose how it resonates for you. But this person was not your twin flame. Okay, this was a false twin flame. This was a lie. Yeah, we have Ace, Earth, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. So you could have that in your chart that you're walking away from this. Or this could, are you knowing that this person was that, wasn't that for you? We have Integration Union. Okay, this person could be wanting to come back and build a union with you. Limitations and fears, but you, yeah. I feel like this is over not wanting to do this anymore. I feel like this person had a lot of limitations. We have control and tactics. Someone was trying to control the situation, control your, your throat chakra, how you how you think of these, but now you're in trans um, transformation collective. Dark night of the soul, chemistry and passion. I feel like you probably have chemistry and passion for someone else. You having uh, chemistry and passion for your own self, okay? Toxic bond and patterns, yeah. There's too much toxin in the situation. You don't want to be bound to that anymore. You want to change. Ooh, okay. So you could have been married to this person until debt tears us apart, contracts, careers, or commitments. Or the person that you were dealing with was in a commitment with someone else and now they're getting away from that toxic bonds of this person controlling and being deceptive. Anything else? Thoughts in isolation. So they're really in their thoughts right now. They're being very much isolated because of what has happened to them. Okay, collective. Let's see. I'm going to pull some, some journey cards and I'm going to close this out. Yeah. I feel like this person is definitely up um, in their thoughts. 
right now about the situation and how um, I'm hearing left you for somebody else. And now they're out that situation and now they can be able to move forward. You know, I'm picking up very heavy that they're fearful because now they have to deal with their own selves. But I really feel like this is a really positive thing. Thoughts and isolation. I really get really, really good positive energy off of this for whoever that you were dealing with collective. Something that has changed, a shift, a new beginning, a new insight. Okay. Angels, ancestors, spirit guide, give me some, give me two cards for the collective. We have abundance. I am a luminous being and I can manifest whatever I desire in this physical reality. So I feel like for a lot of you, you guys are connecting with your heart chakra. I don't know why I'm picking that up. You're manifesting things even more. You're manifesting abundance within your heart because you're having more gratitude. I'm thankful for this life and the opportunities that it that it presents. So with these two cards going hand in hand, and with this card, which I really feel like this is a good card, that this person is in isolation right now, that they're thinking about everything and that they're really understanding that they need, that they're wanting more abundance, more love. They want to manifest this within their heart chakra. Okay. They've been through a lot. They want chemistry and passion. Yeah. The person that they were dealing with, I feel like they put them through a lot, but now they're being gratitude. I feel like they're dealing with their their third eye. They're, they're, it's opening up. Um, I feel like I kind of still see like kind of some residue. You know how like when you open your eyes, I know it sounds weird if you have pink eye, that when you open it up, it has some crust, but their third eye is beginning to open up, to be cleared out, to have a higher connection with, with, uh, with spirit. But this card, I really have a good feeling about this in in this reading, okay? So whoever you were dealing with and they were dealing with someone else, they're in thoughts and their thoughts in isolation, but this is a good thing. It's like they're in hermit mode, okay? New beginnings for all of you, okay? I hope this resonated with you. If you like this, please like, share, and subscribe. I definitely appreciate it. Um, if you're wanting a personal reading, you can click the link down in the bio. I mean, in the description box, and it'll take you to my my website. You can also email email me as well at essence awaken at essence essence awaken at gmail. But everything's in the description box. Also, as well, if you're wanting um, my tarot deck that I use today, this is essence awaken. Okay, on my Etsy shop, it teaches you how to do how to learn to read tarot with playing cards. All right, well, that's all I have for you guys, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.